graduation day. Hi, mamas. Oh, mamas. Oh. And babies, what do you think? So, uh, we moved Pollux over to put the babies in here because we were using the pen on the side of the house. And when Adric was bringing the babies back in, one of them jumped out and squeezed through the thing and ran all the way over to the neighbor's house and got underneath her um, cement porch. And thank goodness Naya has skinny arms and was able to um, get under there and, and get it back out. But so now they're upgrading to this until they get a little bit bigger. And um, like we gotta get, get this lined with wire. That will hopefully be, be this weekend's project um, because then all of the girls can come out and play. And um, I'm pretty sure this one is not pregnant now because we were Ooh. worried that the one that got this one pregnant, Caster, um, he um, got her too. Um, but Ooh. there's been no babies. So I think we're good. Hey. Naya's got a tiny snake hook. <laughs> Is she trying to bite? Huh? Is she trying to bite? No. Well. Can we put her in the greenhouse? No. <laughs> she'll, be she'll terrify people. Yeah. Don't let her go that way. The dogs. I think Mapes is in the house. They're all in the house. Right oh now. yeah, that's right. But the sheep. Mm-hmm. She's too fat for that. She's snake. hot. She's hot. It's okay, baby. It's okay. <laughs> I know, she's so pretty. It's okay. I don't think it is either. It's just a little rat snake. Well, not so little. <laughs> I don't remember the snake rules. I don't either. We probably should look it up. <laughs> huh? I said we should look the rules up. Put her in the box. There. There. <laughs> now we can take her away to the back side of the property. Maybe just back back on the back side of the greenhouse. And I wish I could put her in the greenhouse and she wouldn't eat my toads. Can't put her in there, the turkeys will kill her. Yeah, the toads scare the crap out of me. <laughs> True story, man. <laughs> yeah. I wonder if she's thirsty. Put some water in the box just so she can cool down. Let's put the hydrant on her. I'm sure she's looking for a cool... Dang, that sucks. Oh, that's lovely. Yeah. Put it in the water? No, just put <laughs> some in the box. Oh. Are you thirsty? Oh, it's okay. It's okay. There. See a hot snake? Huh? It's okay. It's okay. There you go. Okay. And yeah, just leave her there. And then she can climb out if she wants. And there. See? Wasn't it hot? It's okay. You can come out. It's okay. I won't kill you. 
No, I wish I could keep you. You're beautiful. Yes, you are. It's okay. <laughs> it's all right. Yeah. Oh. You're allowed here, okay? You can stay here. If you keep Mises away. Oh, it's definitely hot back here. Holy guacamole. Okay, so this one and I are having the conversation about she's really good at making beds. Look at this. <laughs> she said, is that her calling in life? And I said, well, perhaps. And she said, it's a really weird thing to be good at. And I said, ah, you're good at everything. Because she is. <laughs> oh, here comes the elderberry baby. I just cut two escapees. Little ladybugs, oh, not the toads. Sorry. She's gonna go live in the corner, and then I can plant my elephant tall, here as tall as I let it. Last year, next year, we may have to put her in the ground, on a right, right, right there. Right. In bucket? Yeah. Oh, okay. Next year we'll plant her in ground when she goes dormant. Oh, okay. But I don't want to mess with her now. She need more soil. Than that? She probably does. I'm, I probably will. But I didn't want to add more soil when I was going to be the one that leave him in there. Leave him I'm in there. Oh. Yeah. Don't let Maybe him escape. Purpose. Yeah, those are the dead ones. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't want to add more soil when I thought I might be moving her because it was already heavy as heck. But now that you moved her, yeah, that's nice. Cool. <laughs> I bought those stupid things, and I can't give, I can't wear them, so they're gonna be yours. They pop off my head. Really? My head's got a weird shape. It's too much work. Would you say? Is that the tomatoes going in this one mainly or are they going down the middle right? They're going that side. This? Yeah, tomatoes, flower. Right. Tomatoes. I'm talking about this row here. That, that's a walkway. No, this row here. No, this is flowers. All flowers all the way down? Once I get the tomatoes out of the way, yeah. yeah. That's why I was asking. Yeah. Because where the wires are, this one's perfectly in line. That's what your dad was saying. Fine. But this is as high as they were, this wire was as high as it was in the cattle panel. Yeah, well, they all fit in this row, yeah. Well, I think they're going to go all the way down, but because I'm going to plant them in between tables also, yeah. so that maybe I can save seeds. Yeah. Looks great. Oh my gosh. You are magical. Oh my gosh, I am so glad I've bestowed you with my, my magic. What? Checking lasagna. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I love having magical children. <laughs> All right, I can go start spacing some of the maters and then plants and then maters and flowers and then maters and whatever. I've got my carnations. I've got my dahlias. So maybe that will be far enough apart that cr they won't cross pollinate. Although tomatoes don't do that as much as some of the other stuff does. Gosh, it looks good, kid. Oh, I love it. So, when we first moved in, we found two of these guys. 
and Naya kept them in her room over the winter and they're all coming out now in the spring and the little turds scare the crap out of us. They, they burrow in the soil and then when you walk by them they just pop out all of a sudden and scare the tar out of you. And for the longest time couldn't figure out what was making these holes and it's these guys. And we have at least five in here if not more because um, put them back in. Um, this, every time we find one we bring another one in so that they can have babies. <laughs> so we're gonna put a sign that says um, we have guard toads on on duty and don't harass the toads and toads are our friends because um, they bring me joy they remind me of my childhood when my brother and I would catch them when mom and dad had the house that they just sold built those guys were everywhere and then they, the, and then they weren't anymore. Is it a bad sticker? Just put it in the tray underneath the status. That's where I've been hiding them. Mealworms being smart, quit moving because it senses him. My little garden toad was hopping around, so I, I gave him one of my turtle's mealworms. And we're watching to see if he goes after it. But the mealworm got smart and it quit moving. He got it. <laughs> Gone. Just like that. See, I told you, if you stay in here, I will take care of you. <laughs> I told ya.